So my first axe is a Sandvik two and a half pounder. It's my second axe. It's a Grand Force Brux small forest axe. I think everybody knows these. Absolutely fantastic. So next on the list, we have a Granfors Brooks Wildlife Hatchet. A USA Man Edge Tool Company True American. The gem, number two. A Ray Mears Wilderness Axe. Number two, the Criterion. An Elwell number four. Next up here we've got a Gransfors Brooks double bit felling axe. We have a Gransfors Brooks Swedish forest axe. Next up I've got a no name cruiser head on a Gransfors Brooks handle. Here's a plum three and a half pound double bit swamper. I've got a Gransfors Brooks double bit throwing axe. This is the one with the shorter handle than the felling axe. Here is a vintage handmade hatchet made by a, an unknown blacksmith. Next up I've got a Granfors Brooks hewing axe with a right-handed bevel. This is definitely one of my favourite axes. It's a Manage tool company made in Lewistown, Pennsylvania. It is a fire axe. I restored the head, rehandled it. This came from a firehouse in Chicago. Next here we have a Granfors Brooks small carving axe with a right hand bevel. It is a old miner's axe made by Cornelius Whitehouse with the X owner's initials, if you can see that's there, WT. And last but certainly not least, I have a Granfors Brooks American felling axe. Okay, Axe Junkies, that was my collection. I'll lay down a challenge for the rest of you to do a short video of your axes.